Hi year one, so I'm going to show you your first planet that you're going to make, a foil embossed surface. That's going to be great for one of your planets or maybe a moon. So you need to decide on the size you want it to be. So I've got a few different circles. I'm going to go with this medium size one. And you firstly need to draw around it twice on a piece of card. It can be any colour. I'm just using a cereal packet. Okay, so two circles exactly the same. Um, from kind of a nice thin piece of cardboard and then you need to cut it out. With one of your circles, you need to draw some wavy lines any way that you like. Any sort of put that one like that. And I'm gonna kind of do one ooh, a bit like that. Now I want to use this one, not that one, this one, not that one, and this one, and actually I might put one up there. So I want to use that one as well. So anyone without a cross. I'm going to get rid of. So I'm going to cut them out. Doesn't need to be too exact. This was a funny one, wasn't it? Cut that one, and then that was at the bottom. Oops. And that's going to be stuck onto here. So pop some glue and stick it on, and it will fit like that. Oops, a bit more glue. Okay, and then. My next piece, I don't need because it fits there. So I'm just going to get rid of that. There we go. Get rid of that. And then my next bit with a little cross on it, I want to glue that. And it's going to fit across here. So a bit of glue. that leaving a gap can you see how it fits all the way from one side to the other okay, you can see I haven't cut really carefully you can see my black lines and that's okay so this bit without my cross I'm going to get rid of it doesn't matter too much if you get a bit confused about the crosses don't worry basically you're just cutting some shapes and sticking them onto your other circle But I want my shapes to kind of fit all the way across, so I'm kind of doing it like that. But it doesn't matter, don't worry if you get a bit lost. You just want to add some bits that are higher. So this is called a relief because these bits now stick up a little bit from the background. And then you're going to cover the whole thing with glue. Lots and lots of glue. And then, this is the really fun bit. So that's now lovely and sticky. I'm just gonna pop it on this bit of cardboard. So, in fact, I probably should have put it on the cardboard before I put the glue on, because I've now got glue on my table, haven't I? Never mind. So, a bit of foil, so normally we use this for cooking. Oh look, that was lucky, I've hardly got any left. I'll use the last bit. And you're going to spread that over the top. Rub it all in so it all gets stuck onto the glue. And look, rub it with your fingers and you see what's happening. You can see the relief showing where you cut the cardboard and stuck it on. So keep rubbing, make sure it's all stuck down. My, um, oops, I didn't quite put enough glue there. I do want to put lots of glue. And then, I might just be able to tear the edges, or it might be safer to cut around. 
because you don't want to tear the foil that's on your planet. And then you can just tuck that all the way around. Tuck, 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 tuck. It doesn't matter what the back looks like, it can be messy because that side won't be seen. And then you've got a planet Ooh, that can be stuck onto your background. And you could try making a planet, sticking some other things on your cardboard, maybe a bit of bubble wrap or a bit of string or wool. Look, I didn't put enough glue here. Um, you could even try putting a bit of paint or Sharpie pen if you wanted to add some colour. There you go. Now you have a go.